Today is gonna be a crazy day because it's part one of blending the fiberglass panel onto the metal of the car. And once everything is sanded, I'm gonna spray it with an epoxy sealer. But before doing any of that though, the metal needs to be sanded down with 220 grit sandpaper. Unfortunately, since there was still panel bond residue, 220 wasn't cutting it. So I pulled out 80 grit sandpaper and knocked off all the edges before coming back and finishing it off with 220. And once the passenger side was nice and shiny, I went over to the driver's side and did the exact same thing all the way around so I could start cleaning it and preparing the metal for paint. And preparing the metal for paint is super straightforward because all it takes is pouring lacquer thinner onto a shop towel and wiping everything down. But believe me when I say that the car is coming along right on schedule. There's a lot of short attention span people that think the build is taking too long but once they get off the Adderall their blood pressure will stabilize and they're gonna see that I'm creating what's best for my viewers and what's best for me. However, With that being said after everything is masked off it's time for the fun part spraying on primer. And for this I picked up a single use spray gun from Harbor Freight and poured in lacquer thinner to clean out any oils or grease left inside. And once it was clean it was time to bust the water white and mix in the chemicals together. Luckily I already had the measuring cup marked correctly so I poured in the reducer followed by the primer and then the hardener. And when everything was mixed thoroughly I poured it into the spray gun and test sprayed it before spraying it on the car. Thankfully there wasn't that much to cover so it only took a few minutes to finish but after laying down only two coats of primer it was beginning to look thick and glossy so I stopped and decided to let it dry. It's not like I had much choice though since the compressor died on me but nevertheless this was the part I was dreading the most so now that it's over it's time to go on to part two where I'll be laying down Bondo.